On this episode of Sidewalk Sessions, we're going to go over some of the most basic ways that you can go up and down a curb. While you may not encounter many curbs on the mountain biking trail, I promise these skills will translate. There's going to be bumps and grooves in your trail, and this will give you a little more confidence that you can handle your bike. In order to help encourage you guys get involved in this sidewalk session and share your progress with everyone, I'm going to do a giveaway that's going to go along with this challenge, and you can see the details at the end of this video. For today's challenge, all you need is your bike and a curb. To set up your bike for this challenge, first lower your seat to the lowest position. This will keep you from whacking your bum, get that seat out of the way so you can move around your bike comfortably. Next, you want to raise the tire pressure on your bike. Anytime that you're riding on cement, this is a good idea because it will help you avoid striking your rims or pinch flatting. Now, some curbs may be a little bit tall and intimidating at first, and even though we want to work our way up to a good standard sized city curb, if that's too much, start small and work your way up. Challenge number one, riding off a curb. Approach the curb at a medium speed, a little faster than jogging pace. Keep your stance neutral with light hands and heavy feet. Come in coasting with your pedals level and your elbows and knees slightly bent. Make sure that your chin is up and that you're looking ahead. As you ride off the curb, use your elbows and knees as part of your human suspension to help smooth out the ride. Practice this at different speeds. The slower you go, the more challenging this drill becomes. Challenge number two, riding up a curb. If you don't have much experience picking up your front tire, make sure that you start small before you start riding at a full-size curb. Instead of ramming at the curb, we're gonna try setting the front tire on it. As you approach the curb, compress your fork, allow your front wheel to spring up, then set it on top. To keep your rear tire from slamming, shift your weight forward to lighten the load. The hardest part of this challenge is the timing. If you find that your timing is a little late and your front wheel ends up rolling up the curb, take a stick and set it down about a foot before you reach the curb. That's your visual cue when to pick up that front wheel. Challenge number three, riding off a curb at different angles. Riding off a curb at an angle is going to be just like riding off a curb straight ahead. For this drill, approach by riding close to parallel to the edge of the curb. Come in coasting again with pedals level. Try not to make any sudden moves, just relax, ride gently off the curb, continuing to ride parallel to it. Make sure you practice this drill at different angles. As you get more comfortable with these skills, try stringing them together in a sequence. I encourage all you guys and gals to practice these skills. Make a video of you practicing this sidewalk session and post a link in the comments below. I'll be selecting one of our lucky ladies who shares her video randomly to win a free Dusty Betty t-shirt. Thanks for watching, now go shred some sidewalk. For today's challenge, all you need is your bike and...